scientists in Leicester have welcomed the news that their mission to Mars, launched back in 2003, did in fact make it to the Red Planet. The Beagle 2 project was spearheaded by the city's university and National Space Centre. It was widely thought to have failed. But today it was revealed that the probe has been found on Mars and actually came very close to sending information back. As Tom Brown reports. Launched in a blaze of optimism, this was the UK's first mission to Mars. Beagle 2 was sent to the Red Planet to search for signs of life. Back in Leicester, on Christmas Day 2003, the team behind it anxiously awaited a signal that never came. Beagle 2 was lost, the mission pronounced a failure. But today, news that NASA images of Mars had shown an object that is almost certainly the missing probe. We've now got very good evidence it made it successfully to the surface of Mars, which is amazing. It meant that the entry and descent and landing system worked. It meant that Beagle 2 at least started to deploy. It's been a long, long wait, um, but it's great that we think we know what happened to it now. Now, the National Space Centre has actually built a replica of the Red Planet, and we can use this room to show you exactly what happened to Beagle 2. Josh, you're here to help us. Now, we know the probe here got this far. What went wrong from here? So the next step is for the probe to deploy. So the first thing that happens is the lid of the rover comes off, like so. Then the solar panels have to deploy. And we know from the pictures we received today that the first and the second solar panel deployed successfully. But at some point during the third solar panel unfolding, something went wrong. And that's where the probe stopped. And it needed all four solar panels to be operational. Yeah, it needed all four for the power they provide, but also, more key, the antenna for the radio communications is buried beneath the fourth solar panel. With that one not unfolding, we can't talk to the rover, the rover can't talk to us. The mission was far more successful than originally thought. Vindication in part for the project's driving force, Colin Pillinger. The Leicester scientist died last year. Many people were expecting the announcement to be, we found the wreckage of Beagle 2 on Mars. What we've actually seen is how close we were to final mission success. But have no doubt about it, Beagle 2 as a British mission with significant involvement from the East Midlands successfully landed on the planet Mars. It, it's absolutely fantastic. For 11 years, the Leicester team were criticised for their failed mission. At least we now know the Beagle had landed. Tom Brown, BBC East Midlands Today, Leicester. Fantastic. I remember being there when it took off. Yeah, memorable event. And it, it happened was. in the, pro the programme. Yeah, it did. It was brilliant.